This video details the basic steps for composing, solving, and plotting various types of mathematical problems in Maple. During the course of this video, dialog boxes will appear with comments to help guide the lesson. Start by entering the expression sine of pi times x. To get the symbol for pi, type pi and press control space to get the symbol completion menu and select the first option. By right-clicking on the expression, a context-sensitive menu is displayed that contains valid operations for that particular math expression. For this example, you can differentiate the expression with respect to x. Once the desired action is selected, the answer is computed and displayed in line. The operation is automatically documented with an arrow and appropriate text. Right-clicking on the output expression will also open the context-sensitive menu. You can plot the output expression by choosing one of the plot options. Selecting a 2D plot will create the plot of the chosen expression. You can easily make changes and update all or a portion of your work. For example, you can modify the original expression and press the single exclamation mark button on the toolbar to re-execute the differentiation and plot. By right-clicking on the plot, you can display the context-sensitive menu with operations appropriate for manipulating plots. You can change the color of the curve and add grid lines. Using the drawing toolbar, you can add graphical annotations such as arrows. Select the line tool, click to start a line, double-click to end it. Open the drawing palette and use the drop-down list to add the arrow type of your choice. You can also add text or math. Click the text tool, draw a text box, and type in your text. To switch to math entry, press the F5 key or click math on the toolbar. To enter pi, you can use the symbol completion menu or you can enter it from one of the palettes. For functions of two variables, a three-dimensional plot can be made. Once again, right-click on the expression to show the context-sensitive menu. Select Plots, 3D Plots, then X, Y, and the plot is displayed. Right-clicking on the 3D surface opens the context-sensitive menu, where you can change the appearance of the plot just as you did for the 2D plot. Finally, you can rotate the surface simply by clicking and dragging. You can use the interactive plot builder to create a wide variety of different plots and set various plot options in advance. It is available under the tools menu or using the context sensitive menu. Let's animate this expression. Right click, select plots and plot builder. Set the plot type to animation and then click on plot. You can see the animation by selecting the plot and using the animation toolbar.